What is going on guys? It's Alex from TechHarris.com and I am heading to IFA 2019. Straight ahead. Welcome back guys. I am here with a new video. It's been a couple weeks since I've done a video. I was out in Montana and had a bit of a vacation that came back to a lot of work. And uh, so I apologize I haven't gotten uh, any videos up this uh, last few weeks, but this video I decided uh, I was gonna do a quick what's in my bag here for IFA. And I am heading to IFA uh, tomorrow morning and I will be reporting from there and hopefully getting some videos out for you guys. So let's dive inside this bag and see what I am bringing out to the event. All right, guys, the first thing I'm gonna bring, which is obvious, is a bag. And that is the Tilt Energy Backpack. Now this guy's been with me for the past six years. It's almost every CES event and I can't get away from it. This is my favorite backpack. I've got a lot of backpacks in the house, but this backpack I've always come back to and uh, it's, it just works really well. I don't use the power bank feature any longer, but uh, it has great compartments in it and it, uh, it's held up really well over the past six years. So I'm gonna continue to rely on it for IFA. All right, guys, the first thing I got inside my Tilt backpack are a pair of Bear Dynamic Lagoon ANCs. These are the brand new ANC headphones from Bear Dynamic, and uh, they sent these out for review, and I'm taking them to IFA with me to try these out on the long, long flight on Delta. So I will have a full review of these in the coming weeks. All right, guys, the second thing, another pair of headphones. These are true wireless earphones from Optima. These are the New Force B36, which I just reviewed. Gave these a great review, they're top pick. And these are super awesome, under hundred bucks. And I recommend if you guys are looking for true wireless headphones, these are a pair that you should look at. Really great headphones. All right, guys, up next is a USB hub. This has six ports on it with one quick charge port. It's from Ventev. And that will be coming with me so I can charge all my uh, gadgets. And I am bringing an OWC Envoy Pro EX USB-C SSD. Now, this is a brand new SSD from OWC, and it supports read writes up to 960 megabits per second. And they just sent this out to me for review uh, this week, and I am bringing it along. And this will be my uh, where I'll keep my files when I'm doing my photo editing and my video editing. All right, speaking of photo editing and video editing, I am bringing the ThinkPad X1 Extreme 15 inch with a Core i7, NVIDIA graphics, 16 gigs of RAM, and I believe a 256 uh, SSD in it. Now, I, I've used this in the past uh, couple of events that I've gone to, and it's been a great machine. Really love the ThinkPad X1 Extreme. Uh, the 15 inch with 4K display is amazing. So I will put a link down to this as well as everything else down below. And to complement the ThinkPad, I have the ThinkVision M14 external USB-C monitor. Now, uh, Lenovo just sent this out to me for review and I'm bringing it along. What's really nice is this uh, little felt case that they include with it so it'll protect the actual screen. And this thing is super thin, super lightweight, and uh, it's just powered over USB-C right into your laptop. So I'll be able to have two screens when I'm doing my video editing and I need to have two screens available to me. And this uh, form factor is really nice and slim and it fits really nice inside to the inside the backpack along with the laptop. All right, next up is the Huawei MediaPad M5 Lite. And this is a tablet, basically for the airplane. Got some movies loaded up on this guy, some music, and that's what I'll be using on the airplane. For communication purposes, I will be using the Meizu 16S. Now, I have a Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus that's coming with me as well, and we're recording this on that phone right now. Um, but that phone is Verizon, so it won't work uh, very well in Germany. So I'm buying a Vodafone SIM and I'm putting it in the Meizu 16S so I can have connectivity in Berlin while I'm there. All right, on to video gear. Uh, we're recording this on the Galaxy S10 Plus because I did not want to break out my Sony a6300, which I've already packed up. Uh, so that is what I'm bringing to do video with for the most part. Uh, if I have to do it on the S10 Plus, I will. But uh, the A6300 is my weapon of choice here with the uh, Sony 30 millimeter macro lens for product shots, when I'm doing any product shots at the show. 
And then I have my Sony 18 to 105 G Master lens. And this is the lens I use for all the vlogs that I do. And this will be the lens I use for any video that I do while I'm over at IFA. Um, we're also recording sound on the Galaxy S10 Plus with the Rode uh, Smart Life Plus, which I'm wearing on right now. And I'm bringing it back up on the Rode VideoMic Pro. Also got a bunch of extra batteries, extra SD cards, cables to the hilt. So I think I'm loaded up and ready for IFA 2019. I will be uh, bringing you some Lenovo news first thing when I get out there. Hopefully bring you some other news as we can. Make sure you check the website and uh, check for articles that will be publishing in, uh, on the 5th and the 6th and uh, several other things coming throughout the weekend and next week. So if you like this video, guys, make sure you hit the thumbs up. Make sure you like it. Uh, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell. And we will talk to you guys at IFA.